I'm Smita Kuro, a cellist in the New York Philharmonic, and this is What's in My Case. Today, I'm going to take you through What's in My Case, show you and tell you about my cello. My cello here was made in Brescia, Italy in 1900 by Stefano Scrampella. This is my main cello. I play on this cello for orchestra concerts, recitals, and chamber music concerts. I have another cello here, which is my first full-size cello I have ever gotten when I was 13. I literally grew up with this this cello. I don't think I can never leave this one. I use it as a backup when my main cello is in repair. I still play on this one at many concerts. Right now, I tune differently on this one for practicing Kodai Solo Sonata. It's a fun piece to practice. Right now, I am using a set of strings called Perpetual by Pirastro. My colleague Patrick G gave them to me to try on. I am open to try new strings. So far, I am liking these strings. They match my cello's personality. Very sunny and bright. I have been using this uh, Rosen for several years now. It's called Arshet. Um, I bought this in Japan. I don't know if you could see it. I'm pretty happy about this. One thing I suggest is to never use the baseball Rosen if you're a cellist. I have two hard cases. This one is by a company called Cross Rock. This one is a um, champagne color and very cool looking. And I, ca I carry it like this, like a backpack. It's a slim and light, about 13 pounds with my cello in it. This one is Breck case made in Switzerland. I carry this like, like this. About 14 pounds with my cello in it. I think it is important to have a nice hard case when you are taking subways and traveling. I like both cases because they are light, but I prefer using black case because it seals up very tight on the side. Especially in winter and air travel, I feel safer to use this one because of it. I usually have a cloth in my case to wipe off, rosin off my strings like this and quickly clean my fingerboard every time I put my cello away. I think it is most important to really take good care of your cello. During the winter, make sure you put damp it in it so that you can control the humidity level. This one is damp it. Wipe your cello after playing so that there's no buildup frozen in the wood, which could damage the varnish. My practice advice is to take advantage of using modern technology. Using the metronome and tuner is a must. You can get free apps on your phone. I like using Total Energy Tuner when I practice because I like seeing smiley faces when I'm in tune. You should record video yourself playing daily. 
you will be surprised how much you learn about yourself by watching it. I am Sumir Kudo of the New York Philharmonic and this is Maple, my assistant. This was What's in My Case. Thanks for joining me.